Bitch, this is KL Tech Nerd bringing you another uh, episode of my live stream. It's been a fun break, but I'm ready to get started again on uh, seeing what we can build. Uh, before I get started, though, I'm thinking about testing out a couple things. Reason why is it's simple. Uh, it's easier to test stuff in my little test world rather than for me to go and um, have it um, go on and uh, mess up and uh, wasted time in uh, survival. So uh, yeah, I'm going to go into this world right now and start testing a couple of ideas that I had for stuff uh, in survival rather than waiting and waiting and waiting to uh, find out if it even works in uh, survival, I can use creative and just spend it. Uh, sorry if I seem a little uh, off today. I'm just... It's been a crazy morning. But I'm back. At least for today. At least for today. So, let's get started on... Uh, Testing a couple of ideas in uh, creative. And I'll just get some uh, supplies right here. Because essentially one of the things I did definitely want to work on is the bridge. Because the bridge is everything. It's what makes the uh, entire... Uh, It just makes it easier to cross the water, and that's what I kind of need. Because crossing water easier is fun, and it's good. So, essentially, this is going to be what my bridge is going to be like. What I'd like to do is have a... Um, path like this. So, the under part of the bridge is where... Supplies will go, and even uh, villagers, uh, and even me. So that stuff can go across just a little bit faster, a little bit faster. I wanted to have the top part of the bridge be um, smoother and run better. I wanted for it to uh, be clean. I didn't really want a lot of uh, gunk on the top of it. So... Um, Let's say this is a hopper that just got filled up. I want for it just to go. And then it just passes under like that. It's perfect. So we know that that will work. But what we don't know is if this will work. So if we stick a minecart and, like, let's say I get in it, is it going to decapitate me? It's a pleasant thought. So if I get in it, Whee! Okay. So I'm still in it. Okay. Not a very good view, but I lived. Okay. Come on. Okay, there we go. But, uh, yeah, I hope no one minds. I just personally, I, um, would rather test stuff in creative and not waste time gathering resources just to find out that it didn't work versus me um, doing it alive in survival and then wasting all that time all those resources people don't deserve that anyway so now let me see here inventory okay let's go over So, spawn a villager, and let me see if I can get this to work now. Okay, so, boop! There we go. And... Oh, I think that gave him a headache. That will not work. Well, it will work, it's just 
Come on. Will you get back on the rails? For me? For me? Come on. Get back. Back on the rails. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, wow. Oh, come on. Go! So, yeah, I cannot do that. That'll give him a headache. And that'll probably kill him. And that killed him. So, yeah, let's not do that then. Just take care of these really, really fast. Slimes. The only time I can f get sp slimes to spawn. And, uh, what the? <laughs> There's a slime in there. Oh, that's funny. Okay, so there's a slime in there. That's funny. Okay. Boop. And take care of that. Sorry, slime. And then, boop. Okay, so we know now that that is way too freaking uh, small. So we need at least a channel that's two if not more. And here comes another slime. The only time I can get slimes to spawn. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> really? That is just... Really? Did he... Oh, that killed him. Okay. This must be a slime chunk. Unfortunately. And for anyone who's interested, um, yes, I am trying this out in creative, so I don't waste time doing it in survival. And that is my uh, wonderful um, gold farm off in the distance. Kind of cool, kind of cool. Add some of these out here, that way I don't, uh, have to fight the monsters. Last thing I need is for monsters to spawn and keep getting caught in the go-kart. Really? It's a little baby slime in there now. Ah, oh, it's a girl. And it's a girl. It's a boy. Wow, I did not think I would get away with that. <sighs> okay, so there's that. Put a villager right there, and boop! Really? Come on. Okay, so that won't kill him. Okay. That will work then, my friend. So, apparently, the path would need to do that. What's going on? Well, dang it! Freaking zombie! for killing my buddy. Phil. Nobody kills Phil. Uh, I'm gonna call him Nick. Okay, so... That'll work. So if I need to transport uh, people from... through the bridge... I just need this. 
So two high is too little. Three high will do her. Actually, okay, yeah, that sound is not what I want. So, yeah, even too high seems to be okay. Thank you for your services. No, go. You're free. Go. Okay, fine. Okay, so I'm going to put you in there in case I need you again. Put a little light up there. You know, I'll put a roof. That way you'll be safe. I don't want for you to get hurt. So actually, even too high is good enough. So if I do something like this... And actually... Do this... Because I don't want for stuff to get caught in the path, either. Last thing I need is to create a path and then watch a bunch of zombies show up. So if I put, like, maybe something like that... I don't know that well I need to put carpet. I wonder how this will... Look if I put, uh... Half slab up here. Will this block the light? Okay, yeah, I think it will block the light. Okay, so I can't put half slab up there. So... I'll figure out something... Yeah, or I could just put block up here and maybe do something like this. could do that. That doesn't look that bad. Go shh. Through the... Uh, tunnel. Huh. Huh. Right now he's going, I don't like this guy. He's not nice. So, sorry, Phil. Or Nick, or whatever I named you. Okay, so it's not that bad. I can do it as too high, and then have the path be right here. Perhaps. But anyway, though, what I'm kind of thinking for the tunnel is to do that. And then up here, I can use this as a path and walk across if I want to, or I could take a train. And I'm going to freaking kill this guy. Back. Back. Thank you. You're not invited. So, anyway, though, if I go and then do that, then that'll be good. I'll have that path. Oh, dang it. I'm gonna let that guy out then. Eh, I'll leave him. He's, he's safe. He's safer in there. I care about you, dude. So... 
do something like that. So then that gets powered. And ideally what I would want to do is have one of them be like a minecart. And then one of them be a minecart with a hopper. I suppose I could do the minecart with a furnace, but that would just be just plain weird. But anyway though, and then I do this. And the idea is that then I could just do that. And then I could have one line going for uh, people, and then one line going for supplies. And I would probably do something. Come on, get on the tracks. What the heck? It's tur Okay, there we go. Oh, dang it. Come on. There we go. Okay. So then you have one line going for uh, people, and then one line going for supplies. And the whole idea would probably be to have a hopper over there, so I can... Um... Actually, wait. I'm going to go back on what I said, because I made a mistake. chest. Yes, there we go. So then I can do this, so this will hold items. So like, let's say um, this is my base. This could unload items. And then like, let's say I have a massive, huge, huge storage area over here that'll take the items and then just drop them off into the uh, chest and then drop them right back in. And then you climb up here, sit right here, and then you can go across the thing normally, or you could take the train. Um, yeah, I like that. I think it'll turn out very, very nicely. And then I can... Uh, I don't have to... Uh, be... Um, super, super, super big deal. It could just be... Yeah, okay, I like that. The only other thing that I can do that I was thinking about doing would be to maybe have the carts do this and then to have a same thing, rail railway system, but have two carts. So, like, one will... Uh, put items in and then one items will one of them will receive and then that way I could either take them to or from each base and then not have to uh, worry about wasting storage base and then maybe having a train um, up here so like if people need to go across then you could just go across And then you could just do that, and then go across the bridge, and it'll be huge, so... You could just go, excuse me. Doop, doop, doop. Okay. Eh. Eh. Okay. Okay, fine. Oh. Oh, pff, It fell off. Fine, then. Be that way. I don't want to be on the train anyway. But, um... Yeah, I'm definitely thinking that this way, then, I could have, like, the bridge just go huge and then ride it to places and go from base to base to base. But, uh, yeah, I think that'll work. I like that. So let's get started doing something other than uh, listening to me. Makes a game. Okay. So let's go get started on my Twitch website, or on my Twitch Minecraft world. So load it, and see it, and go. And... 
Hmm. I haven't done much here. Um, just same old, same old. Um, I do have a project, though, that I kind of wanted to work on. That I think I will. Because I have a lot of items right here, and... Yeah. I could just go on forever on this, but... Uh, what I was thinking of doing is building a small house, similar to what I did near the other mob farm, that way. And the reason why is because that way I can fill in uh, all of this area, and then that way too I can um, have a place to uh, AFK, or away from controller in this part, because this is a video game controller, and... I'm going to probably flatten out this area in, uh... Make it look beautiful and flatten it out and things like that so I don't, uh... Uh, get lost, and so it's a nice big flat area so I could just build the house onto, and... I, th I figured that'd be a nice little way to start, and stuff. And uh, with the dirt that I get from trying to flatten it out, I can uh, fill in some of these areas. I mean, this thing is pretty uh, uh, big. I do think an AFK area would be good. I only have, like, two iron things, too, so... Ah, it's going slow. Uh, I'm thinking about staying in this area, too, a little bit, so I can uh, kind of clean up this area and stuff and make it better. And I am thinking about adding to this and then putting another uh, villager area over there, uh, probably sometime after I get rid of all of the stuff here clean this up a little bit and uh, get rid of all... Because right now I have dirt on the side of that. I mean, that's not good. I want to have... Uh, clean it up, make it look a little more... Uh, a little better before I start uh, expanding that upward. But I was thinking about it and I was thinking, you know what, if I could get it to work and build like an AFK area right around here then what'll happen is that I can essentially go and add another layer onto here and it should um, double the output of iron that I get. So rather than me going and spending all of this time uh, waiting here for a couple stacks, it'll double and then at least I don't uh, I cut back the amount of uh, time that I have to wait by half. So that's kind of my plan right now is to maybe build one up there. Uh, I'm not sure, though, because I really, really don't exactly like the idea of getting high up in the game. Um, oh, what do you mean? I love it. But um, I'm also wondering, should I just build another iron farm over there? And then that way I just run from iron farm to... I don't know. But... Um, It'll be interesting. It'll be interesting. But right now, this guy, it's not... Cha it hasn't changed too much. It's just kind of sitting here, so... It hasn't changed that much, and... Oh, I meant to do more. I really, really did, but... I had a bunch of job interviews and stuff, and... Yeah... I still have the wheat farm here so I can chow down on food while I'm waiting for stuff to grow. And 
actually I don't even know why I just did that because I'm probably going to end up flattening that out anyway. And you know, I might do this too. Maybe I'll have this be the cutoff point. 